Hi guys, welcome back to this channel. Hi EV Nation, welcome back to our Hi Three, two, one. Welcome to our very first YouTube video. For those who don't know, my name is Ebon Lua Shania, or you can call me EB or Ebon or whatever you want, <laughs> whatever you want to call me. And this video is going to be basically a first time tag question session, first time tag session question, whatever the English is. And I have special guests here with me because like people always say show me your friends and I'll tell you who you are and these aren't all my friends but these are the ones that are available and that are very close to my heart and I love them all so very much so I'm going to go ahead and introduce them <laughs> okay so the first person I have here literally right next to me is Samo Ayolo Apolomi Ijo and i met him at church and he's one of my bestest bestest best friends and he is a third year student i'm gonna say what school he's at <laughs> anyway <laughs> anyway uh read this god does it like yeah like i said i met him at church and he's all about the as you can see and if he's comfortable with letting his instagram out we'll put it in the description box down below and yeah that's him so the next person i'm gonna introduce is the one and only lami gloss <laughs> So this is Olamide and Olamide last name is Raji and she's also one of my very good friends that I met from church. Fun fact, we've only known each other for two years and yeah. And Olamide has a lip gloss business that is called Olamide's Gloss. It's a black owned business and she's just strutting it out. So please, please, please support her. Even if she doesn't have merch out right now, like just follow and engage with her content because you're very good and you're healthy too. So third, but definitely not the list. <laughs> Did I say list or least? Please say least, okay. <laughs> third, but not the least is the one and only Khalifa. So, Khalifa, I met at Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> we stay in the same city, and Khalifa is an amazing, amazing person. She can be shy at times, but she's got an amazing personality, an amazing voice, and yeah. If you ever need someone to take bomb-ass pictures of you, Khalifa is your go-to person. And if you check out <clears throat> her Instagram, you'd see. Okay. <laughs> so, now that we're done with introductions, actually, everybody say hi. Hi. <laughs> hi. We're going to start easy with basic questions. So, how this is going to go is that I'm going to ask a question and we're all gonna answer it together. You get a sense of who I am, who my friends think I am, and who my friends are. Does that make sense? Good, so. <laughs> Fun fact also. Oh my God. <laughs> Your girl did this herself. Oops. Okay. okay. I'm an aspiring makeup artist. So, the first question that we're gonna go into is, Let's start with it. What's the meaning of my name? A gift of God. A gift from God. A gift of God, I think. It's gift of God, but it's very close. What language is my name in? Okay. 
Okay, other people answer. Yeah, I was waiting for them to answer, so I don't have to be the one answering. <laughs> what country? <laughs> Um, what country speaks Yoruba? Nigeria. Nigeria. Look at our students learning. Yes. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is actually let's let's do something. Everyone say what country you're from and what ethnicity Ooh. I think it is you're part of. Okay, I'm from Nigeria and I stay in Hamilton. <laughs> ethnicity, my dear. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. okay. Okay, I'm from Nigeria and I'm from. I'm, oh fuck. Is he? I'm from. No. no. <laughs> okay, I'm from Nigeria. Okay. English is hard. Nigeria and I'm Yoruba. Um, I'm Nigerian and I'm Edo. So I was born and raised in Cincinnati, Ohio. Five months mm -hmm. to be exact. Uh, but my nationality, I'm Nigerian. Period. Next question, where was I born? You know I'm from Nigeria, but where in Nigeria was I born? Ogun State, Ondo State, Ogun State. <laughs> no. Oh, State. <laughs> okay, I can guess. You're born in Lagos. Period. Okay, how many siblings do I have? Two. I have two siblings. I have a sister that's six years older than I am, and I have a brother that's one and a half years younger than I am. What's my favorite ice cream flavor? Mint chocolate chip. <laughs> <laughs> Is the worst ice cream flavor, flavor ever. I love it. It's the best ice cream flavor ever. And Gosh. if you agree and think, actually, let me know what you think about mint chocolate chip ice cream. Thing. Who was my first celebrity crush? Celebrity crush. I used to be obsessed, <laughs> like obsessed <laughs> with celebrities. <laughs> he shot you. Justin Bieber. Oh, quick question. Quick question. Quick question. <laughs> Is he Nigerian or like gospel? Is he Afro? Is he an Afrobeat singer or gospel or? I'm not telling you. You have to guess. My first celebrity crush. Bro. <laughs> Whiskey. This person. I dreamt about this person. I imagined myself marrying this person. What the fuck? I had dreams where this person's parents were like, oh, welcome, you're alive. I used to pray about this person. I, to be honest, I was obsessed with this person. Apostle will hear of this. I will tell Apostle about this. This is what you want to use your life for. Uh, is, it, is it a miracle? No. Is it Mr. Easy? No. Jaden Smith! What the hell? He was so cute. Oh my goodness. After seeing Karate Kid, I think it was called Lord. Okay. What was my first ever cell phone? What brand was it? <laughs> Visa phone? No. I was going to say either Nokia, Blackberry, or Visa phone. <laughs> Nokia. Period! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh that's true. What, what's the fir first app I check when I wake up in the morning? Okay, that's easy. Like, I miss it. <laughs> I message. Yeah, I check my message. I like to check up on my people sometimes. <laughs> okay, so let's let's get a little bit more serious. What inspired me to start a YouTube channel? The fact that you like to talk. Because it's just like something that is natural, right? Like talking is just natural. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Like there's times when like I just yeah I talk a lot and I rant a lot and before it used to be I also used to write poetry I'll see if I can put a clip of like a picture of some poem I've written up here and I used to rant a lot to friends like when they had my time like I could type like five paragraphs about something that I'm angry about and before I used to think I wanted to do a podcast but not a, the audience I'm trying to reach doesn't necessarily listen to podcasts 
and i figured instead of just ranting and keeping this thoughts and everything that goes on in here to myself it'll be nice to share it out with you evie nation so yeah it's so weird actually speaking to camera but i feel like there's people here with me like you're watching me so yeah <laughs> okay let's let's take it down a little bit do you think i'd rather sleep in or wake up early to work out sleep in of course like sleep in <laughs> you're lazy you're rude <laughs> <laughs> you're this is how you said it you're actually rude okay so i'm one of the most unfit people that i've actually come across in my life especially i'm unfit not in the sense that i'm unhealthy no 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 you're lazy <laughs> i'm unfit not in the sense that i'm unhealthy but in the sense that when it comes to like physical sports and actually working out and all of that like i'm the worst person ever and, and i always say like i intend to exercise or like actually get things done but i never actually go through with it so like i've been trying like little basic stuff and i got a waist trainer too so i'll let you know how that works out <laughs> But I'd rather sleep in anytime, any day. I, okay, what's my biggest fear? Not being able to make your parents proud and yourself. Of not being successful in what you want to do, like squirrels. No, <laughs> <laughs> I don't like tiny animals that can run faster than me. Let me just put it that way. But my biggest fear is actually like a lot of and like everyone pointed to like failure, like not being successful at the things that I want. Okay. I'm a church baby. I wasn't a church baby growing up, but I'm a church baby now. <laughs> and I love it. Like the best thing to happen to me is honestly just church. Like I love my church. And by the way, my church is Restoration House Hamilton. <laughs> we have the best choir, the best usher in the department, the best pastor, the best ministers. In fact, everything is just the best, period. <laughs> The best audiovisual department. <laughs> In the description box, I'm gonna put a link to our um, YouTube channel, so you can check it out whenever you want. Like, join us on live stream. What are my life goals? To become a member of YouTube. So, in case you didn't notice already, in case I didn't mention it already, I'm very passionate about. I definitely do mention it already. And <laughs> about human rights and <clears throat> equality and all of that. Okay, so what do you guys, what other, what life goals do you guys think I have? Helping kids, bro, families, yeah, helping kids and family. I love kids, oh my goodness, I love kids so much. Yeah, I love kids, I love hanging out with kids. How are you? Uh, you like your makeup too, so anything that would take off with that makeup business. Exactly. So, yeah, that's the end of this video. Thank you so much. Pony dog. <laughs> Can they put just one MVP? <laughs> Period. <laughs> because I love dogs. Like, and it's funny that I grew up having this intense fear of dogs, but like I really want a dog. Like that's the one thing that I'm praying about like i really really want a dog but i'm not necessarily in the economic and home sense position to have a dog yet but get there. Well, i really hope that this video gave you <clears throat> some insights into who i am who my friends are what my friends think of me what i love and i really just want to assure you that i'm gonna try my best to put out genuine heartfelt original content out here stay tuned keep watching please like comment subscribe share turn on the notification bell do all, all of the above all of it i really appreciate you actually taking time out of your day to watch this video i love you all so much and yeah sure if there's a part of this video that you like it's a perfect clip go ahead screen record it do whatever you want to do
save it in your gallery tell your brother tell your sister tell your uncle your auntie your pastor <laughs> Or your grandma, your your auntie, I think I said auntie already. <laughs> but <laughs> tell everyone about it. I love you all so much. Happy new month and I hope that this year, the rest of this year would be good for you. Because I know it's been hard for a whole lot of people. Anyway, I love you all so much and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.